some more tomorrow afternoon as well. So pizza is just smarter from a financial standpoint. All right, so let's make sure I have a way to open it. I do, and the box, and no one can see my information. All right, you guys have fun. I'll see you on the flip side. Hello, hello, hello. How are we doing today? My name is Spectrum Dominus, and this is the February Pro Wrestling Loop box opening. We open it up live on my channel on Twitch TV, twitch.tv slash Spectrum Dominus. You can come check us out. I've got all my viewers watching now. We're about to open the box and see uh, what February has in store for us. Um, we very excited about these boxes. The last two have been really good, and then we had before that a couple of, of down boxes so I'm a little little hoping that we keep it they keep it up they're trying I think ever since uh, the WWE loot box came out they're trying to up their game a little bit and uh, I think they uh, have done a pretty good job all right so as always I'm gonna open towards you guys so that you either get to see before me or at least at the same time as me oh I think I saw something that I'm going to guess is going to be my second ever Lucha mask. It sure is. Look at that. Now, I don't know if it's an official um, Jushin Thunder Liger, but that is very um, Jushin Thunder Liger-esque. So here we go. We got a Jushin Thunder Liger esque mask. And then it feels like something else that might be a t shirt. But it seems a little small for a t shirt. I'm going to open this up. I don't normally open them up, but it, it seems like, like it's going to be less of a t shirt and more of a. It's not a t shirt. It is. Oh, it's like a wall scroll. And it's a chick of some sort, so that's nice. Looks like it's a hot chick. I probably can see it on the screen better. I don't know who that is. All right, so anyone on my... All right, so taking that off because I can't even see, but that's awesome. I was going to do the rest of the... Uh, I was going to do the rest of the video that way, but I can't even see who this is. Mickey James. It's Mickey James. It's hard to see, but if you turn it the right way, and I was looking at it backwards, the name is down the side, and it's Mickey James. So that's kind of cool. She actually looks better there than she does in person. I'm not a big Mickey James fan, but that's a nice picture of her. They did a good job on that. Uh, but it's uh, you can see it's got little rivets in the side, so it's a wall scroll. It's a nice... Uh, Nice fabric, uh, kind of, uh, I don't know, plasticky. All right, something else that's fabric but not a t-shirt. Looks like it is a, oh, is this an American Alpha? No, it's a Kurt Angle. That's even better. That's even better. For those of you who don't know, I am a huge Kurt Angle fan, and um, I am going to the Hall of Fame to see him inducted uh, in... March, the end of March. Kurt Angle, that's my guy. That's my favorite wrestler. And I have made the list, for those of you who don't know. Um, so that's very cool. All right, feels like a DVD. Uh, best of 2016, five incredible matches. So this is where they go off and they do a bunch of people that I have never heard of. Joe Gamble versus Judiz. J U. D-I-Z-Z. -Z. Okay. Social Crazy versus Mike Camden. All right. Golden State Championship, Anthony Idol versus Jew Diz. Okay. This, oh, this is SoCal Pro Wrestling. I didn't even see that. SoCal Pro Wrestling. Uh, so this goes in with my, I'll probably watch it once and then, uh, but... 
Judiz versus Dirty Doug versus Destro versus Adrian Quest versus Andy Brown in a Golden State Championship ladder match. And finally, Tommy Wilson versus Mike Camden. Um, yeah, I know Pro Wrestling Loot tries their best to pump those indie guys, and, you know, I understand that they're wanting to send the love there, but, oh, my gosh, is that almost useless. All right. And then, finally, I think, finally, we have... Nope, feels like there might be more. Oh, no, that's going to be the card telling me what it is. So, we have our autograph and cards and stuff. So, we have our autograph for this month is... Is that Jack Evans? So, you guys can tell me who Jack Evans is. I have no clue. I'll look into that. The... Card this month, 12, Underground's Dark Lord of Lucha Libre, No Fear. Uh, I'm Up to this point, every one of these cards have been WWE. So I don't know if this is something I'm... But I'm thinking that he went away from WWE and this is going to be like a Lucha Underground guy or something. <coughs> Pentagon Jr. Okay. Is that the card is Pentagon Jr.? Or, oh, and then this one, this is a million dollar bill that says Rainmaker, Rainmaker Kazuchoka Okada. New Japan Pro Wrestling Kazuchoka Okada. Okada versus Kenny Omega. So this is what everyone's calling the match of the year that came out literally the fourth day of the year. A six-star match. No one's going to... Um... Oh! So you're saying that this mask here, that's the only other mask I have, is the guy... Oh, let's see if it tells me. Wrestling match, a legend in Japan, a logo towel... The next card in the line is none other than Pentagon. Now, if you look, the Mickey James, it could have been the one I got, or it could have been her in lingerie. Let's see if that'll focus. It's not going to focus. Come on, camera, focus. But I'm just like, how did I not get the one with her in lingerie? Although she looks more like Mickey James in the lingerie, when I don't find her very attractive in that one. Not that one that bad. So it, it, that's a pretty good um, box. I didn't. It did not have a wrestling shirt in it, but I am getting overloaded with wrestling shirts. So a change of pace from a wrestling shirt is not a bad thing. Uh, the mask, um, definitely going to need to find another tape ball. I don't know if you guys even realize that's my tape ball um, to put the mask on. And if not, this one's going to get priority over that one. Um, the, the dollar bill is not anything that I really care about because it's New Japan. In fact, now that I look at it, aside from Mickey James, and even Mickey James could be argued as not WWE because she just joined back up. Only the Kurt Angle, again, could be argued not WWE as he just joined back up. This is a very non-WWE box, but they managed to pull out enough WWE in it to make the WWE fans uh, um, happy. I do think that I'd have to count this as not necessarily as good as the last two, but um, definitely still up their game. I do like the box. I think they did a great job on it. So, guys, if you if you want, uh, if you like the video, click like below, subscribe uh, to the channel. You can head over to twitch.tv slash spectrumdrominus and follow me there. So you can watch these uh, videos live. I do a lot of uh, wrestling talk, wrestling games, and uh, prediction shows. I will be filming the upcoming Elimination Prediction Show tomorrow on Saturday. Um, this may go up to, on Saturday, so it may be today on Saturday. Um, so check me out there. And uh, check out Pro Wrestling Loot if you like the stuff. It's really not that expensive. It's $26, I believe, with shipping, and that's that's for the upgraded expensive box. They have lower price boxes as well. So check it out there. I'll see you guys next time you stop in the stream. Bye-bye.